I'm Paul, the Outdoor Adventures, probably lot. We're gonna head off with our fishing rods and our pack rafts, and we're gonna head to the backcountry of Wells Gray up in BC. And this will be our first father-son backpacking trip. Grizzly country, mosquito country, and uh, hopefully we won't see anyone except fish and some wildlife. I'm looking forward to it. What about you, buddy? I'm definitely looking forward to it. So, the water levels are high, and uh, we should have a bit of rain today, but tomorrow should be beautiful. So we tried this modern road, and it didn't work. There was complete washouts. Um, as I was saying, there were like the just absolute, there's no way to pass it. So we had to go down another forest service road. I don't know, can we cross it? Somebody closed the gate on us. Well, I don't think anybody else has made it up here. <laughs> Right trail. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I think we can move these. I think we will. So we tried moving the trees, it didn't work out, so we're gonna try another road. Alright, I don't know if you can see that road behind us, but that's we just spent about half an hour navigating that and I think it was a waste of time and it might have gotten us stranded. Um, just because it's gonna, well, that or hope my dad's SUV doesn't get damaged on the way out. <clears throat> but if you watch this and it's on my YouTube channel, there's a chance that we made it out okay. <laughs> Otherwise, I have a lot of explaining to do. So we're here, we're about a kilometer from the trailhead, which is, we're gonna get on the map and compass, but I believe it's somewhere around there. We're gonna hit the trailhead from there, and, uh, and then we're gonna hike the seven kilometers, uh, four and a half miles. There. The marsh that we just came up was there following this creek and water going up there. Paddle Mountain's over there and we're heading this way following the creek down and we're going to take a bit of a ride. We left the creek that way and we're coming across this meadow with a long log which is buried by moss and we're going to head this way because we're heading north towards um, where we believe the other road is based on the map and the GPS. This is where we believe the trail has. Creek is about 10 yards on our right. We're coming downhill still. Wow, look at the size that moose came through recently. That's crazy. He probably heard us and took off. <laughs> All right, we're back to the creek again. Following the moose, I don't want to, but. So how do you like our route finding? Good. Yeah? I'm not so sure. <laughs> so, I turned on my phone and we were going off course. We were going south when we should have uh, headed northeast. So, we were going west actually. This just shows you how much you can get turned about on your route. No flash photography? This is pretty rough. This guy's tough, man. Good thing the wife doesn't see this before we get back. Now, we gotta climb up. That's where we came from. Well, after my GPS failed, we used Isaiah's compass on his uh, phone, because my other compass is flaky, to find north, and we looked at the map, and we tracked and knew that if we came up this hill in a straight line north, we would hopefully find it. And what do we have here? So we've uh, got it. We've got our trail marker. In fact, there's a whole bunch of things. So we've done it. Now Google, I'm sorry, but your Google Maps failed. We kept saying we were 150 meters from where the trail started, and we and when we were zero meters away, we're in the middle of a clear. Yeah, there was nothing around, so not cool. But now we can see the line of flags. We're gonna follow it. All right, so. Things are getting fun. A little bit of post holing, not too much. But uh, definitely 
following the trail. All of this right here is what we've just had to navigate on our way down. There it is, the lake ahead. We're gonna make it. Oh, this is a good sign. It means we're almost done. We walk. We've been walking this bridge for years. This is purely so mom knows that we brushed your teeth. Dinner was good. Caught a fish. Caught some sausages too. <laughs> they were delicious. Cooked, cooked them up. It was awesome. And I wash our dishes. We're gonna take a look at the lake for a minute. Let's go do that. Can you hear that? Okay, so today was one of those adventures that you don't plan for and you're very th thankful That they turn out the way they did. Yeah, buddy. Definitely. Yeah, so got a bit Lost relying on my phone's GPS, but ended up we uh, talked it out and got uh, my bud's uh, son's uh, phone's compass and we used that and our map that we brought with us and uh, it's a good thing we had those things and we're able to, to come across at an angle and intersect with the trail. Anyway, now, um, little project we worked on. We have a crib board and a mini deck of cards and uh, some fun. <laughs> 